ships and men against the elements. Through the frozen Great Lakes, the new United States Coast Guard icebreaker Mackinac cuts a vital path. Behind her, cargo vessels en route from Duluth to Chicago in the earliest midwinter crossing on record. The Mackinac grinds through 20 inches of solid ice at eight miles an hour. Urgently needed in the war effort, these newly built ships would normally be marooned on the Great Lakes for two more months. Now, they are delivered on time. Infantry landing craft in storm-tossed Atlantic seas on the way home from Sicily, Salerno, and Normandy. These are small ships, but seaworthy. Veterans of landing missions throughout Europe they are still fit for new assignments in the Pacific. Typhoon off the Philippines. An American carrier plows through raging seas in a grim 48-hour fight with a savage tropical storm. Crewmen, battling winds which threaten to sweep them overboard, tie down planes which have broken loose on the carrier deck. Wind velocity reaches 75 miles an hour at the climax of this merciless storm. Some craft of this task force are lost but the carrier is safe. Ships and men win a battle with weather. 